final gospel of truth, the land of impossibility, where God make impossible to become possible. If you come to IGTC, all kinds of sickness, all kinds of problems, come bring it. There is nothing that my master Jesus cannot do. Master Jesus can allow Brian to see. Master Jesus can cure all sickness. Master Jesus can turn all problems aside. Come and have an encounter with Jesus. Good evening, viewers, and welcome to the Salvation Hour, an hour where we spend time with God, an hour where the great sea doors are open, that you will call and ask questions, and you will be praying for a lot of people today. I want to thank all those that are joining us for the very first time, Canada, Australia, USA, God bless you, Nigeria, all African country, and IGTC in Ghana, God bless you for joining us. And I also want to say thank you. If this is your very first time, your life will never remain the same. In IGTC, we have a logo that says, with God, all things are possible. And this time, we are believing Christ for his resurrection and his deliverance. Join us tomorrow at the Jericho, our life and direct with his great seer of our time on Facebook. He will be live from 7 p.m. to 9.30 p.m. Tune in, share and like and spread the gospel. On Fridays, our prophetic buffet. Once again, live and direct on Facebook, Twitter, YouTube, login. Sylvester Menu is the logo. Go in there and watch us and share the gospel. We want to reach everywhere. Those in Solomon Kingdom for watching us, God bless you. Grace you of our time. Thank you for coming. I mean, God, God bless, bless you. God bless you, woman of God. Amen. We thank all viewers that are watching. You are blessed to watch this year. Amen. I know we are still praying. We are believing in God. With him, all things are possible. Amen. Today, the telephone lines will be open early and those who want to call for prayer you can call me the number on the screen and i'm going to pray for you i'm going to pray for a lot of people today amen. and we are still praying we are believing in god yes. we serve a mighty king yes amen amen and we i want to wish everybody that our lord and christ jesus we have already renewed one of his covenant again amen. that god christ our lord is what alive amen hallelujah i'm going to continue on the message i preached about last week it's all about uh, don't be afraid. Yes. Don't be afraid. Amen. Because the world is going through a lot this time. And I want to prove something to all believers, those who are watching me, that we, we are not alone. We are not alone. Amen. We have God on our side. And our God is greater than all. Amen. I want to prove one promise that our Jesus Master told us. Amen. After his resurrection, he said, he said, all power in heaven, mm. all authority in heaven oh, yes. has been given to me. Oh, yes. Go and make my disciples. Let me tell you something. So for you to accept Jesus Christ as your Lord and Master, as your Savior, this means you are more than conqueror. Amen. The enemy or what is going on mm. cannot what affect you. Hallelujah. Because your God is bigger than all. Amen. This is the time for us to have faith in him. Yes. This is the time for us to believe in him. Yes. Because with him, all things are possible. possible. So the one secret we have to do, one thing that we have to do, this time of difficulty time that people are dying, this is the time for us to call the name of God. This is the time we have to ask for the blood. This is the time for the covenant of Jesus to be what? Renewed. Hallelujah. This is the time for God to what? Remember Hallelujah. us. So Hallelujah. Fear bring destruction to us. Fear can allow us to lose our focus. Fear is not a good thing. Mm -mm. So this is a time we have to be bold. We have to keep praying. Yes. And we have to believe in God. Amen. And I know through God, all things are what? Possible. possible. My God. My Hallelujah God. to Amen. the Lamb of God. So those who want to call, the numbers are there. You can <coughs> call me the studio number. And those who are watching me, Facebook, God, God Almighty bless you. Amen. So Mr. Manu, everything is on the screen. Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, those who are 
commenting, those who are liking, those who are subscribing. May God Almighty bless you. Amen. And it's now life. And I know we are praying for our country. Yes. We are praying for the world. Yes. That God will come in and what? Intervene. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Amen. Praise the Lord. Amen. Amen. So we are going straight to the word of God. We are taking something from the word of God for the book of Timothy. Timothy, we are saying what the word of God is saying. Yeah. And I know tonight God is going to bless you. Amen. Timothy chapter 2. 2 Timothy chapter 1, verse number 7. The Second. Bible says, For God did not give us a spirit of fear. The Bible says, Our Lord Christ Jesus did not give us the spirit of what? Fear. fear. Amen. Amen. Fear is not from God. Hmm. The Bible says, When God sent his angel to come to heaven on the third day, when Jesus time was up. When the angel took away the stone and the door, there was no what? There was no stone again on the tomb. The Bible says when Mary Magdalene went into the tomb, there was an angel. The angel appeared to them yes. and the angel said to them, the angel said to Mary, don't be what? Afraid. afraid. Amen. Amen. Don't be what afraid. So, Hallelujah. beloved, those who are watching me, anything that is going on right now in this our world, Jesus. we have God. Amen. Our God is bigger than all. Amen. Don't be afraid. This is the time for us to hold in prayer. Yes. This is the time for us to call our God. Yes. Let me tell you something. If we don't do anything about it, people it will even make jest of our God. People mm. will think that our God is dead. Let me prove something to you. Our God is still alive. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Jesus is still what exists. Glory. Don't be what? Afraid. afraid. So the angel said to Mary Magdalene, yes. don't be what? Afraid. afraid. So the moment fear come to you, when you read the Bible, the Bible will keep repeating fear, fear, fear. So anytime there is fear, Satan will come and take what? Control. Oh, yes. Satan will come and what? And rule. Yes. So fear is not a good thing. Oh, yes. That's why David said in the book of Psalm 23, the Lord is my shepherd. I will not fear no what evil. evil. So those who are watching me right Glory. now, God is your shepherd. This means you are not going to die. Amen. No matter what is going on, no matter what the enemy is doing, Amen. we have God. So this is the time for us to prove the power of God. Amen. This is the time to silence the plot of the enemy. Glory be this to is God. the time for us to stop any wind that is blowing. Amen. This is the time for God to come and what? Intervene. Glory be to God. Praise the Lord. Amen. 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 So anytime there is fear, Satan is ruling. Mm. So the angel gave an answer to Mary Magdalene. Don't be afraid. afraid. Don't count a living among the dead. Mm. They were thinking that the Messiah cannot come back. But the angels said, don't count the living among what? The, the death. death. So fear is not a good thing. So the warning the angel gave to them that don't be what? Afraid. afraid. Amen. Let's see what Timothy 2 is saying about yes. fear. And he said, but of power and of love and of self-control. But he's telling us that we should not be afraid. We should trust in the Lord. He said, for God did not give us a spirit of fear. Amen. But of power. I'm coming. Amen. For God did not give us the spirit of, of fear, fear, but the power. God did not give us the spirit of fear, but what? Power. Power. And Jesus too said, power in heaven have been given to me. Yes. Authority in heaven have been given to me. Oh, yes. And the same power have been given to us. Yes. So this mere Fear is not having dominion over us. So mm. this is the time for us to call the name of God. Amen. Every day and night people are dying. Yes. So we are calling our God to bring this thing to an end. Amen. We are not scared of what is going on. We are not scared. The Bible says we will live and we will declare the good words of the Lord. Amen. So this means our God is bigger than all. Hallelujah. So those, those who are watching me, this is the time for us to hold hands together. Yes. Now that we are at home, this is the time for us to call our God. Yes. This is the time for us to prove our God. Yes. Something happened for a reason. Mm. We are not alone. Yes. And one promise our Lord and Savior Christ said to us, whilst I'm going, there, there, there will be a comforter. Mm. There will be a helper. Yes. And this helper will come to you. Yes. And I'm, I am with you 
till the end, end of time. time. So this means our Christ and Lord Jesus <laughs> is with us till the end of time. Amen. So this is a proof that we are not what alone. Glory. This is a proof that we are not alone. Amen. So any fear that is coming into the world, any fear that is coming into the people, that people cannot even do anything, we drive away the spirit of fear Amen. in the name of Jesus. Because we are not alone. Hallelujah. Our God is still alive. Glory be to God. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Lord take your time. Hallelujah. And take your time and just give me this reading for me. Yes. The book of Matthew 2. Let's go to Matthew chapter 28. Yes. 28 verse number 18 and see what the word of God is saying. My God. The Bible says, And Jesus came up and spoke to them, saying, all authority has been given unto me in heaven and on earth. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. So, why are we scared? Mm. Amen. Amen. This is a time for us to fold our hands yes. in prayer. This is a time for us to call the name of God. Yes. Let me use something to you. Mm -hmm. Don't be afraid, part two. This yes. is the part two. When it comes to the time, the Bible says God sent a man. And this man was a prophet. And his name is called Yuna. And he told the man to go to a land that he is going to destroy the land. Mm. Let me tell you one secret about the Bible. So, you now know that the city, they are full of evil. They are not doing things in the sight of God. So, he's, he started to what, divert to go to his own way. At the end of the day, God sent him to the promised land to go there to deliver the message. So, you now delivered the message. So, after he had delivered the message, the king said, no. This is what one thing we have to do. Amen. Amen. The only one thing that can stop this calamity, this the thing that is going on in the world is I'm going to give you the secret. We are, we all have to come together. We all have to start to pray. We have all have to call the name of God Jesus. for our God to what intervene. Amen. Even if the world have sinned, mm. this is the time for God to what to remember his Amen. covenant through the blood of what Jesus. Amen. Let me tell you something. Mm. So when it came to that time, mm. the Bible says the king where sat low and he have he, declare, he, he made a declare that all my people we are not going to eat all my people we are going to the house of god and we are going to pray now churches are closed but everywhere you are you can pray everywhere you are you can call the name of god oh, yes. and your god is going to what answer you Hallelujah. so the solution for this thing that is going on First, we should not be afraid. Mm. Second, we should call the name of God. We should believe in God. People are in their house. They are scared. They don't know what to do. I want to prove something to you that Jesus has given us assurance that he is with us till the end of time. Amen. So why are you afraid? afraid? Mm. My God, my Father. Glory be Amen. to God. And power in heaven have been given to me. Oh, yes. Authority in heaven have been given to me. Amen. That says our king. Mm. So why are we afraid? Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. This is the time for us to pray. Mm. This is the time for us to call the name of God. Mm. The reason why, the reason why the, the, the king, I'm talking about David, said, the Lord is my shepherd. Mm. If David said, the Lord is my shepherd, he knows that he's not alone. Mm -mm. Even when even he's in darkness, when even he's in darkness, God is what? With him. With him. So Hallelujah. this means no amount of Things that is going on in the world should not what scare you. Hallelujah. The only thing that we can do, you you call yourself a Christian, any religion that you are, you have to be combined, and we should call the name of God. This is the time for our God to what intervene. Amen. Because we are not alone. We have to stick on the promise that Jesus gave to us. He said, He is with us till the end of time. So Glory this means we God. are not what alone. Glory Woman be of to God, God. Why do you, what do you understand by this message? It is very The telephone Amen. calls, are, the numbers are on the screen. I'm praying for people. You can call the number on the screen. You can call the number on the screen so that I can pray for you. The lines are what active. I'm going to pray for you right now. Woman of God, what do you understand? It is very this? interesting because yes. I think sometimes we limit God yes. so small. Yes. God is not an infinitesimal. It's not something that is so tiny yes. that you cannot manage. It. It's a big God, so yes. we should think big, and we should also trust and take fear away from ourselves. People are terrified because of this Praise COVID. The Lord. Amen. Amen. God bless you. Where are you calling from, and what's your name? I'm calling, calling from Dara. My name is Sheila. 
Sheila, may God be with you. I bring, oh God, your daughter Sheila before you, my king and my father. I bring a household. I bring herself, a job, whatever that she's doing. Father, we pray, oh God, that you will speak in her situation. You will speak in her condition. You will be light in her. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Amen. Is there Sheila? Praise the yeah. Lord. Yes, may the protection Amen. of God be. Uh, 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 have I given you direction before you call me? Amen. Have you called me before? Yeah, I've called you before. So what Today the, I was calling about my mom. Okay, so where is your mom? She's in Africa. She's feeling dizzy every time. She's dizzy. Okay, I use you as a point of contact for your mom. Amen. I pray for your mom. Anything that is coming, may God Almighty cancel it. Amen. Fear is not your portion. Amen. The Bible says your mom will live and declare the good words of the Lord. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Uh, it, it's Amen. Then there's one number attached to the landline. So after you can call me uh, 20 minutes time, you can call me and I'll tell you something so that I can do for your mother. Okay, thank you. God bless you. God bless you. God bless you. So, woman of God, what do you understand by this? Message? Fear is a factor, is a foundation of destruction. Yes. When fear comes into you, yes. it begins to break every chamber that you have. Yes. Fear is what the devil used as a step stone mm -hmm. into your life. Yes. Once you have fear, psychologically, physically, you're already damned. Yes. You're saying to yourself, oh God, this is happening. Like Sia, you were telling us the other day, when people have fear, they have small headache, they'll say, I think this is COVID. Whatever comes in, begins to generate the atom of fear in them. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Your name and where are you calling from? I'm calling from Nottingham. Nottingham. My dear sister, what do you want God to do for you? Well, as you're talking about fear, but I'm not fearful because I'm trusting in God. God bless you. Amen. I'm proud of you, sister, because our God is bigger than all. The Lord exactly. is your shepherd, so you are, you are. God bless you. So, what do you want this year to do for you? Um, just continue to trust the Lord and to go deeper into Him. God bless you. God Amen. bless you. So, let me pray for you, Father. I pray for your dear, dear Amen. daughter. Amen. Father, I release your protection. Amen. Wherever you are calling from, may God Almighty protect your family. Amen. For the trust you have in the Lord, yes, you and Lord. your family, you are saved. Amen. Any storm, anything that the enemy will bring, we cancel it in Jesus' in name. Jesus. Amen. May God remember you. Amen. God bless you. Amen. God Amen. bless you, my sister. God bless you. Your family, Amen. you are saved. God bless you. God bless. Amen. I'm coming. Amen. Please, those who are calling, I love the, the 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 atmosphere, the way you are calling me with boldness. Amen. May God Almighty bless you. Amen. We are not alone. This is a proof from the seer. Yes. We are not alone. Mm. So we have to stand and pray for the people who are... Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Uh, your name and where are you calling from? My name is Ancestor. I'm calling from London. I want to pray for me. I have... Please, please, I can't hear you. Can you please speak louder, please? My name is Satu. I'm coming from London. Mm -hmm. I want to pray to you. I pray for me. I have fibroid in my home. Fibro. Okay. Can you please take a warm water quickly? Water. And let me pray for you. Oh, man of God, charge yourself and pray for you. Amen. When you're ready, let us know. Oh, call back for the next caller, please. I have only. Okay. I have water now. I have water now. Jesus Christ. Holy Spirit, we keep Basant any fire brought down I cancel it in the name of Jesus. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. So shall it be. Drink it for me. Amen. It's gone. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Amen. You call me and you give testimony. Amen. They, they want to do surgery. Mm. And the surgery they want to do, the, the surgery yes. will be that they have to take your womb. Mm. But I don't like that. Mm. So mm. Uh, there's a number that end with 8-8. Eight, eight. The number the ending of 8 is so call me tomorrow 2 2 p.m. 
tomorrow 2 p.m. Okay. and I'll pray for you and I'll give you a direction because I saw that you'll be having an hospital appointment mm. for surgery but because of this COVID, because of this virus, nano, they will postpone it. But I will pray for you. God is going to stop it. God Amen. Bless you. Amen. God bless you. Please, those who are watching, tomorrow, 7 o'clock, I'm coming live on Face, face the, uh, Facebook, Facebook, 7 o'clock p.m. to 9.30. Amen. And Friday, too, the Prophetic Buffet will be live on Facebook. Hallelujah. 7 to 10. Yes. 7 to 10. Yes. Every, the details are there on YouTube, Facebook. You can get me Wednesday, 7 p.m., to 9.30. It's all about prayer. We Amen. are praying for our country. Amen. We are praying for the world. Hallelujah. We are praying for God's Hallelujah. intervention. Hallelujah. It's time for us to call God. Oh, yes. It's time for our God to what intervene. Amen. So tomorrow, the seer will come live on faith, um, Facebook, 7 p.m. Yes. And Friday, Prophetic Buffet Amen. will be on what? Facebook. So yes. you can log into the Facebook or you can log into the YouTube and you can see the seer live. Calls will be open. Any prayers you want from the seer, I'm going to pray for you. Join me. Let's pray for our world. Let's pray for our country, for God intervention to come, for God to flash things that is going on. Because Amen. what I saw in the realms of the spirit, mm. the only thing that can keep this our country safe is what we are doing. Amen. We Amen. need to pray for God intervention. Amen. Praise the Lord. So Hallelujah. those who are calling, the numbers are there. Mm. I'm I'm taking two calls more and I'm praying for people. Anything you want God to do for you, if you want prayers for your family, if you want anything, you can call me right now and I'll, I'll pray for you. So woman of God, yes. about this broad message, a yes. woman called that is happy, he's not scared of anything. <laughs> he believes in God. I love that. I love that. I want people that have what the confidence. Oh that yes. They are not alone. Oh they yes. They are not scared. Because oh, yes. they have one God. God. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Because they have God. Amen. Amen. I love the woman that called that yes. he said that he's not scared. Mm -hmm. He have what? He loved God and he believed Amen. in God. Amen. Amen. What do you have for us about this message? Boldness is a factor for Christians. You cannot. Amen. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Call her your name. Where are you calling from? Good evening, sir. Praise the Lord. Your name and where are you calling from? My name is Mela. I'm calling from Italy, sir. Italy. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Have you called me before? I called the last two weeks, sir. Okay, so you have been watching. May God protect Italy. May Amen. the protection of God be on your country. Amen. My sister, what do you want God to do for you? I want God to deliver me from power of that. Because I see a dog. If I close my eyes, I see a black dog walking up on top of, on top of my face. Anytime you, sleep, you, you, you see a black dog? Yes, sir. Okay. Amen. Anything that the enemy has said. Holy you, Spirit. Anyone that marry you spiritually. Lord Jesus. And Lord Jesus. is causing any man that will come Jesus. into you to, to go in your marriage. That you can't have a permanent or you can't have a someone as your husband mm. from today. That black dog, I crushed that dog in the name of Jesus. Amen. May God Amen. set you free. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. My sister, tune in tomorrow. Still in tomorrow. Facebook, Sylvester Menno is on the screen. Tune in tomorrow, 7 to 9.30. Call me when that live calls are coming. Call me. I'll pray for you and I'll mention a name to you. I'll mention a name. God have taken my spirit into Nigeria. I'm taking it to Nigeria. I've gone to a city in Benin. Benin. So when you call me, I'm going to give you details and what I saw, what is going on there. So Facebook, I'll be there live 7 p.m. 7 p.m. tomorrow. Sylvester, man, just send me a friend request there and you can watch <coughs> on what? YouTube. Amen. God bless you. Sister. Amen. God bless you. Amen. God bless you. Woman of God, say something. We have, I'm answering one call. Praise the Lord. So those who are watching me, tomorrow is Jericho Hour. Jericho Hour, we are coming live on Facebook, 7 to 9.30. And Friday, too, is what? Prophetic Buffet. It's 7 to 10.30. We are praying for the country. This is a time for prayer. When you call me, it's not about your problem. We should leave the problem aside and we should pray for oh, this yes. thing that is oh, going yes. on. Because oh, what yes. I saw in the realms of the spirit mm. is no good. Mm. We have to stand and pray for this evil mm. virus to 
come out from our system because we have a mighty king. Hallelujah. We have, it's so sad that all churches in the world is closed. Even Easter Sunday, churches was host on online. It's so sad. And the the temple in Jerusalem is closed because of it's so sad. Mm. Amen. Mm. This is the time for us to call the name of God. Yes. This is the time for heaven to speak on our behalf. So, beloved, if you are at home, this is the time for you to pray. This is the time for us to call God because what is coming is no good. Mm. We need prayer for God to heal our land. Amen. So connect with me tomorrow, 7, yes. 7 to 9 on Facebook. Book Hallelujah. and Friday to Facebook. If yes. you log in, you can see what is going on. We are praying for God healing on our land. Amen. God you. Amen. You God says Child of God, the Bible says that in Psalm 56, verse 3, you said when you are afraid, you should put your trust in God. God is the only one that will take away this fear. Fear is of the enemy. Fear is a foundation of the enemy to step into your life, to put sickness, to put barrier, to put limitation. But God is assuring you, our logo is with God all things are possible. Tune in tomorrow and watch the great sea of our time. He's got so many messages and he will be breaking the yoke of the enemy because God has given him the authority to do that. And there is none like him in this country. I want you to tune in. Trust in the Lord. Remove fear. Remove limitation. Remove barrier. Whatever that is making you fear. Remember today's topic is be not afraid. Don't be afraid. Trust in the Lord and your life will be, remain, remain the same. You will continue to be blessed. When fear comes, break it away. Remember the word of God. Be not afraid. Don't be afraid. Trust in the Lord. When you are afraid, hold your Bible and say, fear is not of me. Fear is not to come from God. It comes from the enemy. May in God bless you Jesus. in Jesus' name. God, be highly favored. Possible. God Amen. Possible. God bless you.